Hello again, my name is Hugh and welcome to my channel. On last week's video I mentioned the fact that I'd gone over 500 subscribers on my channel, which was great. So I thought this week I would do something to celebrate that. Um, and what I'm going to make is something that's going to end up with at least 500 individual pieces of wood in it. Um, for once I've actually done some planning on this and worked out to get down to the 500 I'm going to need to start at around 11, 1200 individual pieces so that when I turn it I end up with 500 pieces. So yeah wish me luck because putting a thousand pieces in something I've never done before um, so yeah, so it's time to get changed and start making this project. I'll uh, see you at the end. Take care now.
Uh, hello. Um, just thought I'd put it into the machine. In. Um, this you saw me throw it. I did something I've never ever done before, and for the life of me, I do not know why I did it. But when I got to this stage, I thought, I know, I'll speed it up a bit. I'll use accelerator. And as we all know, what accelerator does to Supergirl or CA. Uh, yeah, it calls that. So that's coming off. I can still use the tube for something else. So when I made the blank, um, I always make more than enough. So I have loads of pieces left. So as you saw in the video, I made this one with no veneers in between, just straight, straight joints, and it worked a treat. So I'm going to take this to the sander to square the ends off because if I try and use a barrel trimmer on there it'll rip the ends to shreds uh, because of the, the size of the pieces. I have counted there's 122 pieces of wood and veneer in each of those layers which means there's over 2100 pieces in this blank. So my aim was to end up with a blank with at least 500 pieces on it, which I'm more than sure I'm going to end up with. So this is day four. Uh, it's taken me three days to get to this stage. So it's time, as always, finish the tea, get out in the workshop, get this trued up and get it on the lathe and let's make the pen. So I'll see you at the end. Take care. Hello again. Here it is. One 500 piece segmented pen. I love it. Um, as I said in the middle bit, three days in the making of of the blank itself. Turn in about five minutes. So that's the way segmenting is. Um, do you know, I didn't put a 
super glue or CA finish on it. I used the project I got in the post this morning, funnily enough, uh, Wood Wax 22. And yeah, I like the finish. It's very, very tactile. Uh, nice and, and touchy-feely sort of thing. So yeah, that one. What I didn't say was during those three days, I made another blank as well, which has also got more than 500 pieces in it because I wasn't sure if that one would stay together so I always try and make an extra one as a spare um, and that came out really really nice as well both kits are Epsilon uh, from Taylor's Murfield that one's the gold and that's the antique copper one thing um, I had a recount it wasn't 18 layers it was 21 which meant there was over two and a half thousand pieces originally in that blank. So, if you've liked what you've seen, and give it a thumbs up, share it around with your friends. If it's your first time here, thank you very much for watching. Hopefully you've enjoyed it. And if you want to see more, if you click on my little icon in the bottom, you can subscribe to the channel through there. And then if you click all, on the notification bell um, YouTube will let you know when I upload my next video which is normally a Thursday morning to all the the oldies uh, thank you very much indeed for your continued support and the new ones um, I really do appreciate it I'll put some stills at the end of both pens so once again thank you very much for watching uh, take care, please stay safe. Jochabau, Hoyle, see you next week.